Introducing the 2021-1 Schrodinger release. Let's take a look at some of the new features and enhancements. In the 2021 release, we introduce the new OPLS4 force field. OPLS4 sees advancements in better solvation, it addresses overhydration of charge groups and overstabilization of salt bridges, and addresses subtle but systemic underhydration of neutral organic material and also a better sulfur model, addressing understabilization of sulfur oxygen and sulfur nitrogen along the sigma hole direction, and improved interactions along the lone pair direction for thioethers. Overall, OPLS4 has led to improved accuracies in FEP plus and MD simulations across a broad range of chemistry. In Maestro, we see a new option to quickly select an antibody-antigen interface. This can be useful for visual inspection or refinement, such as after a protein-protein docking. The FEP Plus panel now supports analysis of protein FEP Plus results. Using a familiar layout as with small molecule FEP Plus, the Overview tab provides a quick glance at predicted affinities or stability results, along with the ability to add experimental values for comparison. The map tab allows one to explore the map topology and delete problematic edges and closely examine hysteresis. And the analysis tab, we see more details for all edges, edge classifiers, and ability to quickly load trajectories and representative structures into the workspace. Over in the ligand designer, we've expanded support to non-protein receptors such as ligand RNA complexes where one can visualize growth space renderings and potential ligand RNA interactions. And during enumeration, we've included the option to quickly access the R group creator panel directly from the enumeration settings. This allows any user to create their own R group library for use in the ligand designer. Over in IFDMD, we have a new advanced option to pick additional residues to be included in the refinement of residues in the IFDMD docking process. In the ligand alignment panel, we see a new option to flexibly align macrocycles to a reference ligand confirmation. The macrocycle method employs a stochastic approach that tugs atoms to their optimal alignments and requires an MCS partial match for some of the macrocyclic ring atoms. And finally, we introduce the beta version of the new and improved protein preparation workflow. The new protein preparation workflow provides a single location for both interactive or automated protein preparation, vital to all downstream applications like FEP+, molecular dynamics, docking, etc. All preparation tasks, including selecting from ligand states and optimizing hydrogen bond states, are front and center, making it easy for novice users to produce well-prepared proteins that will result in better predictions. While advanced users will find it easier to bulk prepare structures using a validated protocol, lowering the barrier to modeling with different structures. Interactive mode allows users to explore what different preparation settings do without having to run the full protocol. And unlike the current protein preparation wizard, optimizing hydrogen bond assignments and cleanup are no longer hidden, encouraging users to perform these essential steps in protein preparation. The new protein preparation workflow can be found next to the existing protein preparation wizard. Feel free to favorite the menu item and to get one-click access from the favorites toolbar. And as with all betas, please send feedback to help at schrodinger.com. Now these are just some of the highlights from the 21-1 Schrodinger release. For more details, please visit schrodinger.com forward slash new features.